book three. I am Megalodon Hype. Hello, buddy. My name is Blue, and welcome to the reaction video. Mm, okay, this is book three of Infinity Train. It just came out today. I have successfully avoided any promos, any trailers, and we're here. This is the first five episodes, I believe. I am hyped as shit. Because so far with the pattern of these books, they just keep on getting better. While I love book one, book two, I feel like that was like a huge jump in quality as well. Like I already love how book one dealt with divorce, like a really heavy subject. Book two came in and it's like, are you a real person? Who are you? It was just cool as shit. All right. Now book three is out and I'm interested to see what they do here. So, all right, I guess without further ado, let's just freaking start. I am so excited. So let me match you in three, two, one. A Max original. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We're back in the hell zone. Is the protagonist going to be someone in here? No, shit. Really? How are we going to handle this? She's in a deep shit right now. That's a huge ass number. All these people got a huge ass number. They're like, they're not technically bad. Well, I mean, they are destroying carts and stuff like that, but they're definitely misled because they think Amelia was the original conductor. And these poor kiddos are getting fucked up because of it. When I look at you, I see me. Now it's been a minute. What is her name again? Oh no, they're gonna fuck up the play. Uh-oh. Hey, we're here to crash your party for no reason. Highest number gets the pick of the raid. Oh. Ah! This is awful. I hope she like learns by the end of if she is the protagonist, I think this could be good for her. Yeah. <laughs> wow, great. You're gonna set everything on fire. That Grace? Already up 14. Grace. Alright. Simon Grace. Got it. Done. Oh, oh, oh. oh hey. No oh, shit. I was 10. How long have they been in here? Oh, all these denizens are dead, by the way. Oh no, don't hurt the poor dude. That is fucked up. Oh my god. I feel like they could get away with a lot more now that it's on HBO, actually. Oh, this could be interesting. Hold up. Because already there's like fucking arson. Like that guy just got decapitated. Wow, that's. Train doesn't have very much protections to prevent people from doing this. Oh my god. Let's fucking go! This is going in my personal stash where don't tell anybody, but I'm gonna. She's lying to all the kiddos. Please help! Oh my god. Are you wheeling back for a pu I thought she was just wheeling back for a punch real quick. That would have been really fucked up. Wheel it or whatever. Wheel it? Oh, sh oh my god. Lucy thinks it's a person. No, no, come on. This is exactly, this is going exactly against the entire message of the last book. You're boring me. Oh. Understood, Grace. No, no, little kiddo. I want it. Put it in my room. Is Simon gonna... Hopefully, maybe. I'm still on the foreword. You wrote the foreword. I know. Is it great? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, they are ah. So, oh, it's they're so misguided. No, maybe we should not do that. That's not how you get off. That's not how you leave the train. Oh no! I if you touch this car, I kill you. Oh no! Kiss the shelf. Run! Ah, oh, shit, here they are. I'm reassuring my kid, Kevin Jr., not to worry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're just gonna break into people's homes! It's not really breaking in when your house has no walls. Oh, yeah, they didn't fix that part. Oh, come on! Everyone's just being a dickhead. Hmm. Oh, beat the shit out of it. I'm alright. Just beat him up. Oh, should have known that in your training. Oh! It, oh, full on explosion? What? This car's a shifter. Oh no, you're getting took! You're getting taken somewhere. No, fuck you! Simon! Oh, bye, Simon! They get separated and then they start learning! You better, swear to God. You've got a grappling hook. You're an idiot. You're not using that. Oh! Get spinal crunched. Oh my god. Yeah! Bye. 
<laughs> oh shit. But now the whole world is flying away. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's routine. Ow! Oh. You got kind of fucked up. Oh, yeah, there's an exit. Oh, no, oh, ow. Friction would let you would be a red smear. Oh, get fucked. You're gonna die. <gasps> Holy shit, Simon's getting ganked. Okay, oh my god. Can't be that far. Nope, you kind of got screwed up. You're very far away right now. Horrible little robot. I think you don't know what's up. 47 cars away. Okay. So I guess this is going to be the premise. They're going to try to get back to the mall, but hopefully learn the truth cuz I don't think they're they're bad, but that stems from them being misguided. If they know the truth and know it's the truth, I think they have the potential of a redemption, but... Oh, and also we get a new theme, too. I, that, that, that was not much melody. Oh, shit, yeah, both. Oh, ooh. Okay. I'm interested to see what's going to happen there, because they're kind of fucked up. They got a thing going down their whole arm. Okay, I guess I'm just going to jump directly into episode two. Mm -hmm. A little bit late on that one. Okay, so we're right where we left off. I don't think we've even been this far out on the train before. Yeah, maybe you can learn something. Jungle themed. Oh. Flare? Ooh. Stop destroying shit. Do you really need to do that? Don't you hurt that lizard. No, not the freaking lizard. Loosen up. I don't know. He's into that. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> These cars are so cool. I, I love the creativity in the cars, but like, don't destroy them. Don't be a dickhead. <laughs> Look at this music! What's going on? Dude! This is freaking great. Oh, monster? No, they're running. There's something here. Oh, shit. I use the boots that you just had. Those are some neat boots. I wonder if you have something like that and you take it outside of the train, do you get to keep that? Because that'd be pretty neat if you had that in real life. I think I found something. Oh, you found Feld's tree. Oh God, you're gonna get crunched. Yeah. Okay. When encountering a null that cannot be overwhelmed with force, nor avoided in its entirety, the null in question must be incapacitated. They're always seeming to do things with force. Yeah, they're always seeming to do things with force. They never actually want to talk it out. I don't think whatever this is is going to be able to be talked out with, but, like, they don't want to solve problems. They just want to punch it until it goes away. Have marshmallows? I'm sorry, what? This is where you want to redeem your loss at Chubby Bunny? I maintain that they're <laughs> still the champion. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. You know what? This this might be where we meet the, the animal companion for this book. Oh, no, he got took. Goodbye. No, you're getting took as well. Vibe check. Oh, shit. Well, that's it. Rest in peace. Oh, no, you're alive. Oh, you're in a nest. Oh, bird? Avian? Do we get an avian companion this time? That was one of my predictions. Thinking avian, reptile, or monkey. Monkey? Monkey? <laughs> oh, you're getting tickled by monkey. Is this actually monkey? Monkey! Yeah! And of course. Monkey! Oh, never mind. It's a, it's a person with a monkey. No, they're gonna they're gonna realize that people who are null apparently, according to them, also have personalities and they're real people. So stop being dickheads. We want to make sure you're getting everything you're entitled to for the train. No, not a passenger. So <laughs> I can't believe it's actually a monkey. I like that was what I I should have said it in the intro. Oh, monkey's angry at you. Monkey's gonna kill you. Who told me we don't hit? Okay. Good monkey. Hey, Tuba. Hello. Tuba can talk too. All right. Hazel. Hazel. All right. Grace, Simon, Hazel, Tuba. Got it. No confusion this time. Hopefully not. Please don't. I will be over here. Watching. Watch. Yes. Do you have a number? I do. No, you ain't! No, you don't. The fake conductor was trying to hide her from us, turning off her number. When that's what I was trying to tell you about before. Uh, don't already, don't fill her head with shit. Yours should be glowing. 
It's probably written on with something, maybe. We can teach you all about numbers. Maybe we can get you're a Sagulo like mine does. No. Nah. -uh. Other cool kids. No. Yes. Yeah. Hazel, you need to run though. This is not good for you. I'm not leaving Tuba. Yeah, no. Do you think we can just grab Hazel and run past that thing? Yeah, no. Tuba will beat the shit out of you. Once we wean Hazel off it, we'll ditch the null before we get back home. Oh, man. I don't think it's gonna work out quite like that. Of course we want both of you to come. Oh, my God. Oh, man. Are you sure this is what you want? We were setting up a home here. Uh, I mean... my whole life. See, so already there. My whole life. How long have you been in here? I don't think you're a passenger. They're gonna realize she's a null too. They're gonna grow attached and realize she's null, and then they're not gonna wanna be rid of her because they're already attached. Got it. I already just predicted the entire shit. I could be horribly wrong, but I think that's what how it's gonna play out. Cause I don't think that's not a real number. I don't think it's a mechanic where you could just turn the number off like that. Oh, sh the shit changed. Hello. Oh my, has autofocus been on this whole time? Okay, I don't think it's a problem. I forgot to change that around. Shit. But okay, there's the premise. They're trying to get back to the mall. I'm thinking they're gonna realize she isn't a passenger. She's she's a denizen of the train, but it'll be too late. They're already attached. They're mostly attached. So they can't just go like, oh no, you don't you don't matter at all. You are not a, a real personality. And their entire belief, their fucked up belief, is gonna be flipped on their head. That's that's my prediction right now. But mm, I, I I love how this is starting out so far. I think that's such an interesting choice to have like pretty much the antagonist as the protagonist this time. Like they're bad. They're not following the rules. They're beating everyone up in every car they go in. They're kind of fucked up and they're the protagonist. I think that's so freaking interesting. But okay, that's it for this video. So hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.